Tony here. Hope you're all well. And it's that time again. <clears throat> the FI Friday. Do you know, I don't, I don't know if it's me, but these Fridays just seem to come round so quick. It must be me. It must be just getting older. Um. Okay, I got some patterns today. Um, off. Uh, Amazon. I didn't realise it cost, cost US sizes, so I've had to thingy them up, see what they are. But the by simplicity, and these are supposed to be uh, beginner to immediate. Is it in, intermediate? Intermediate. <laughs> immediate. Intermediate. Beginner to intermediate. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to check out the patterns and you know sort myself out with them. But I got that one. Because actually, my daughter is looking for some kind of prom dress like this. So, that's why I got that. Uh, these are the same, but a little bit shorter. You know, look at that. $18.85 $18 is that. 95 cents. Flipping neck. What was that? About 15 quid? Something like that. For a bloody pattern. Um, and the last one was... Although I do admit, you know, that's got two patterns in one. You know, they've all got two patterns in. Um, actually, that one's got three in. This one, this one, and this one. You know, so, and this one's got two in as well. This is uh, Snow White and uh, Cinderella, is it? Yeah. So, I'm going to have a look at them. <clears throat> They come today. I was also supposed to get some material today, but that didn't come either. Um, and also, I'm still waiting on um, the the uh, haul that I did at the works. And like I said, I got uh, mainly, I think, Christmas stuff this time. Um, there's nothing really to to add. I, you know, about my thumb. I've been to that. Um, my CT can't. CT scan come back clear so you know <clears throat> like I say I've just been on the internet and um, you know doing other things like looking at patterns and stuff like that because I really want to get into my sewing I've just actually I think my printer's on its way out although I have had it 10 years <laughs> um, but this was just for a, a little penny for um, pattern so I've just sat and I've cut and put all that together uh, so I might ever try it that this is pretty easy because the lady that actually does this um, they call her Angela Kane she's on uh, YouTube and she explains things you know and she does them from start to finish and she explains things um, putting darts obviously if you don't know what darts are they're these little things here um, they're like a fold, a fold over people also know but they're like a fold over just makes it look a little bit smarter um, <clears throat> and I often wondered how he did them I've seen uh, the other girl Angela Clayton uh, do hers but I can never um, I never got the gist of it this lady does it and it's like oh <laughs> you know, it's, like, it's like something comes on in your head oh um, so I've just cut and done that I've also um, cut out some more patterns that I've got uh, and I'm writing things down as I need them and stuff. I went yesterday and got some more needles. The needles, I've got hundreds of needles, but they're really small eyes. And I, you know, I mean, my eyesight ain't brilliant. Um, so I thought I'm gonna have to buy some bigger hard needles. Um, so that's what I did. I did that yesterday. Um, I got some, um, oh, what do they call it? It's not webbing, is it webbing? No. Oh, flipping neck, I can't remember the name of it. Anyway, I got some of that. Off the internet also, um, I got some carbon paper. Um, I didn't get no chalk, but I got the markers. They're like little pencils with brushes on or something. Um, and carbon paper. I also got some, um, what was the other one? I got the little uh, tracer wheel. Um, and some other uh, little bits and bobs that I, I needed so um, 
I did do, oh, I'll show you this because I did do this yesterday. I found out where it is. There we go, there it is. Okay, um, my original plan for this was to put, I have some um, wooden circles. Now, I don't know anybody maybe that, um, I don't think it is cross stitch, although it might be. Uh, where you put a piece of material in between two circles don't you and it has a little like a screw on the top well it's them but without the screw my original plan was to make a bag and put them on you know wooden handles um but it didn't quite turn out like that so i did the bag now what i did was i turned it inside out and put the lining on as well so I'm not messing about and just did it all the way around. The lining is actually, um, it's like a, a, a cordy type um, material, you know, and it's got like Paris on it and things like that. So I did all that and like I say, I was going to put these handles on and then, um, in fact, I did put the handles on, but it didn't look right. So I took them off again, tried something else, tried something else that didn't work. I didn't like that. So in the end, I went for a Velcro fasten there. And I just put like a little, I had some material left over. So I did a running stitch and um, so it was like crinkly and just stung it. So it was like that. So that was my uh, effort at a little bag. What it is as well is I'm trying to get like my stitching straight. I'm not very, you know, I'm not very good at straight either. But actually, I was quite, um, you know, I was quite proud of that because my stitching was actually excellent. <laughs> so I did that and I thought I'll just keep that for my little, you know, bag, um, for my little things in my bag. Uh, my daughter, Rebecca, she wants one as well now. Um, not not like that. I think more hers is more lengthways she wants, um, you know, with Velcro. Ideally, she could do one with a zip. Um, just to put her lips, you know, little um, women's things in and deodorant and stuff uh, to go in her college bag. <clears throat> so I'm going to have to have a look at that and sort that out as well. <laughs> um, and that's about it, really. Like I say, I, you know, I'm just more into my sewing this week. Uh, and I'll be looking into that over the weekend as well. What I'm going to do with a bit of luck because I was supposed to do it this week but with everything that was going on um to do some excuse me to do some de-stashing um because I you know there's just I've just got so much stuff um I was in fact I've got some um you know the square magnets that go on a wall for your dies I have I think I've got 12 of them and I'm just like Father and where to put them, you know, because there's like there's no with these cubes being along here, you know, there's kind of no no room, and I'm I'm trying to sort that out and and uh, and one thing and another. So I've just got so much stuff, so I need to de-stash really. Um, but that's what I'm going to do over the weekend with a bit of luck. I'll sort it all out and then maybe get it on here for. Uh, for next week um i still don't know what rebecca's doing yet she hasn't made a mind up she's um you know she's just getting her head down at the minute she at college um you know cause she wants to go on um and do other things uh, she was talking about law last night so whether you know that'll will do we'll have to wait and see um but Apart from that, guys, not more to tell you. Um, yeah, there's not more to tell you. Uh, if you do have any questions, please leave a comment below. Uh, and please subscribe, because that really helps me too. Uh, also, uh, check out the other channel, uh, Hayley B. At, um, <laughs> do you know, I, I always get it wrong, but I'll put it in the link below. Um, we should pick an easier one, really, shouldn't she? Um, Sparkle Stitch and Stick, <laughs> Hayley B. She does some great tutorials as well, um, hauls and you know uh, room tours, stuff like that, and some tutorials she's got in there. 
um, I've just watched one actually from uh, a couple of months ago I think it, or, or last year sometime uh, when she did Brave the Shave and I was like you know that's that took some um, you know not want for a better word some bollocks you know <laughs> so you know good on you Hayley um, yeah so I'll over to her channel I'll leave a link in the description below um, and if I don't see you before I will see you uh, hopefully Monday um, so have a great weekend guys whatever you're doing and have a safe weekend and I'll see you next week thanks for watching guys love you loads bye bye for now